All right, welcome back everybody to more Grandia 2. So, um, we're just gonna rush to the end, huh? <laughs> what a exciting start to a video. We're just gonna rush to the end. I wish to thank you all for everything you have done for me. <laughs> hey, you did your fair share too. It has been quite a pleasure and quite an adventure as well. Much remains to be done with all. The wise man still tends to the fire, though it burns brightly. Thank you so much. I just do not know how to thank you enough, my friends. It's my job. Don't mention it. Don't say that, Ryudo. Excuse me. Excuse me. How did you... He said that before he came in? It's a little weird. Miss Elena, come to the cathedral right now. His Holiness Sarah is overjoyed by the news of your arrival. Right now? In the middle of dinner? I'm not yet ready. Can this not wait? Uh, we shall bring your things later. His Holiness Sarah is looking forward to having dinner with you. Please, do not make him wait. Hmm. Ah, no, I must not do that. Everyone? R Ryudo? Don't spoil the moment, kid. By now, you know what to do. Good luck. Miss Elena, please take care. Your kindness is indeed a rare treasure, Elena. Thank you all for everything you have done. I will not forget you. Don't cry. Don't cry. Miss Elena, she's gone. She is. And now we turn to other matters. Well, our job here is finished. I don't know why it's this guy like that. Whatever. Yeah, job's done, but... I'm feeling a little sad about the whole thing. Go figure. Right, I think we're just heading straight to the cathedral, aren't we? Yes, sir. I can see it. The day of darkness is near. Valmar's moon, too. Its vile shadow is growing ever stronger. Valmar is certainly attempting to revive. You must understand this. Listen, Elena. Your mission is important, not just for you, but for the world. The darkness must be resealed in. Doing this will require all your effort, the power of Lord Granis and the Divine Sword, the Granis Saber. You must find it, no matter what. Fail, and the world is doomed. I understand. You must succeed in order to remove the darkness within you as well. You must prevail. I understand. I will not let you down. Hmm. Who was that man? I'm guessing if you've played the game before, you probably know. I already know as well. Never been one for goodbyes. More hellos. Can't help but feel a bit sad when someone like her leaves. Yes. Were Miss Elena with us, we would be able to see the inside of the cathedral. I presume it interests you. Yes, Miss Elena often spoke of the confrontation between light and darkness, but I don't quite understand. At all. Light, darkness, Granus, Valmar. Can't tell them apart. As well, I am not versed in matters of religion. So, we might just find out something there. It's the priest. Mr. Ryudo, I presume? What... What's this? I'm busy. Didn't your church drill some manners into you? Or did it just drill through your head? <laughs> I apologize for my rudeness, Ryuda. The Pope has called for you. Please, come to the cathedral right away. Look, I realize word of my amazing singing voice has spread everywhere, but I'm not interested. His Holiness Sarah has a special request. 
Ah, please, bring your companions also. I beg my leave. Hmm. This is a little bit weird. The Pope has a special request. Sounds like the first time, first line of a really bad joke. What kind of person is His Holiness Sarah? I understand he is said to be the sage who will save the world. Which isn't nearly as impressive as the sage who will save his breath. This better be quick. Better be quick, huh? Ah. Nice sip of water before we continue. Yeah. <coughs> All right, let's <clears throat> head straight to the cathedral, which is that a way? No, that's the wrong way. What do people have to say? I know what we'll have for our family breakfast: some homemade bread coated with lots of squeak bar butter. What the hell is squeak bar butter? Our family can hardly start a day without eating some of it. I'd better start making it. Your whole family gathers for breakfast. Wow, I'm quite envy envious of you. Too bad Elaine is not with us. Ugh, we need to get to the cathedral now. I wonder what happened to Elena. Let's just head to the cathedral. I think we're heading the right way. Wow, this town's actually a lot bigger than I remember. Lovely music. Do-do-do-do-do-do. This place is really white. It must be hard to clean. <laughs> I'm impressed. Yeah, this place is massive. If you can hear the wind noises. Holy crap. They should have played this scene out like um, that scene in um, El Dorado, where they're climbing up the giant steps and they're absolutely exhausted. <laughs> Holy crap. That's a big church. Or cathedral. Quite remarkable in its proportions. The thoughts of its architect twist and wind almost palpably through the sculpted stone. How beautiful. It must have taken forever to build. You must be Mr. Yudo. His Holiness awaits you in the audience chamber. Alright. Wonder what the, the dude wants. Stop gawking. Move it. Not like a general, Ryudo. Like a general. Stop gawking, you stupid sons of... Hoors. Cathedral Lobby. Alright, um, do we talk to this guy? Just, yeah, alright. Mr. Yudo, please, go inside. I'm sorry, but your companions must wait outside. Didn't he say my friends could come? He has important things to discuss with you, so... Oh, it's alright. I don't mind. I can wait. Can I at least wait somewhere interesting? Ah, our library is most interesting. There you will find many important books about the doctrine of our church. Mr. Yudo, can I talk to you really quick? There might be some interesting information at the library. I will check it out. Clever boy. More clever than other little boys I know. <laughs> what other little boys do you know, Sky? Hmm, that's a little... <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. Sorry. <laughs> um, so may I lead you two to the library? Oh, that's the priest. <laughs> yeah, go lead. Well then, Mr. Yudo, please go in. <laughs> you two. <laughs> this way, please. <laughs> I guess they're laughing at that. This way. <laughs> Uh, that was funny. Ryudo, we'll be waiting in the library. Go ahead. Yeah, I'll meet up with you later. Alright, let's head inside. Ugh. My nose is itchy. I need to trim the stash.
The service is still in progress. Please be quiet. This way. This place is freaking massive, dude. Bring to this world light, peace, and harmony. Your Holiness Zara, please calm our anxious hearts. What can we do to rid the world of the terrifying darkness? You must bolster your soul. If you leave no chink in the armor of your soul, then the darkness will be forced to leave. Please save us from Valmar. You must not falter. We must all not give in to darkness. I cannot save you. You must save yourselves. Your Holiness Zera, please lend me your ears. Yes, what should we do? Holiness, what will Zara, happen to Holiness. the world? Quiet. We are here to bring peace to the world. How can one do so in a panic? Everyone, please calm down. Yet, your highness Zera, the recent rumors of the revival of Valma are not going away. I have even had reports that the rumors might be true. Right, High Priestess Selene? At this rate, the day of darkness seems unavoidable. But we must not strike fear in the hearts of the people we are trying to save. Doing so would surely go against the will of Lord Granus. What do you say, Cardinal Oro? Oh, when the day of darkness comes, the world will most definitely be destroyed. Ah, I don't know what we can do. Celine, do not misunderstand me. I'm not saying that the action the Cathedral Knights took was wrong, but you went too far. You must not frighten the people away from Lord Granus. Yes, Your Holiness. You must all remain on guard, so that darkness cannot take advantage of you. Please, everyone, back to your rooms. And the voice acting just stops. <clears throat> ah, Mr. Yudo, please, come. Nice speech. Please, accept my apologies. I did not mean to make you wait. That was an awkward handshake. I'm sorry for having called upon you on such short notice, but my request is not an ordinary one. Please, to the next room. Helena? Huh. That was, um, a bit weird. Hey, Sky. <laughs> He's coming out of nowhere. nowhere. Looking for little boys, Sky. <laughs> Let's head to the Pope's room. He's got room. I thank you for what you have done on Elena's behalf, but now 
I have a special request to make. Before we get to that, tell me, what about Elena? Will she be all right? Ah, you ask if the presence of Valmar can be driven from her. Sadly, I must tell you that that is beyond even my power. However, if the Sword of Granus can be recovered, there may yet be hope for us all. This is why I have asked you here. Keep talking. I want you to find the Divine Sword, the Granus Saber. The sword which slew the Dark One must be returned to us if the light is to be restored to this world. You still haven't made an actual request, but I get the idea. Yes, Elena has told me much, enough for me to know that you are the only one capable of contending with the darkness. Naturally, this request must appear absurd to you. However, as your reward, we shall give you whatsoever you request. Hmm, suddenly this conversation has become more interesting. However, when you depart, I wish for Elena to accompany you. Why bring her along? You sure you don't want to cast a few words against Mil Valmar instead? Unfortunately, we can do nothing more for Elena now. We would be unable to protect her from Valmar even if she were to remain here. She will be safer with you, Mr. Ryudo. You're right. Your request is absurd. The pieces of Valmar struggle for dominance, each attempting to devour the others in order that the darkness will be restored. According to prophecy, once the pieces unite, the day of darkness will become upon us, and all mankind will be destroyed. So, what do we do? Sharpen a pointy stick? Lord Granus is yet to recover from battle. Thus, our world heeds, heeds, heads towards darkness, lacking the guiding hand of light. Were we to possess the Granus Saber, we would at least be able to bring back some of the light of Lord Granus. Then can Elena be saved and our world protected from the advent of the Day of Darkness. Any idea where the sword might be? Unfortunately, our holy book says only that it rests with the Legion of Darkness. I'm sorry, that's not vague enough for me. Could you be a little less specific? I need some time to think it over. I will wait until tomorrow for your answer. I have prepared rooms for you, so please, stay here tonight. Ah, but I see that I have tired you. Rest and return tomorrow. But please, consider my offer. I hope you will accept it. Hmm. Can we not... Elena, are you alright? Has something happened? Oh, do not worry about me. I just want to think long and hard about Pope Sarah's request. Or, not you. Alright. I guess so. Let's think about it. Elena, what's with you? Ryudo, do as he asks. Please. Not for me, but for everyone. The world. Well, let's go meet up with uh, Merrick and Rune. What could His Holiness be thinking of? Mm -hmm. <laughs> At this rate... Cardinal Loro. Ryudo, I believe, was your name. Just what did His Holiness Sarah tell you? Huh? He asked me to find some divine sword. I see. I question his holiness selection of his emissaries. A task this great surely requires someone with more experience. Careful with your words, aren't you? Old man. I'd be as careful with my judgment were I you. Experience I have. Patience I don't. Insolence. Listen well, stripling. It is best to abandon your search, for it is not for a churlish whelp to find the Granisaber. <sighs> Tell you what I'll do. I'm going to ignore you, and then I'm going to leave. You just stay here. Stay. Stay. Good boy. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Ashes. 
What could His Holiness Sarah be thinking? That fool boy's in in sessions I don't know. will be our ruin when the day of darkness comes. Ah, whatever shall we do? Mm. Meh. Meh. <clears throat> All right. Let's find the weird duo of American Roan. Just standing in the way there, dude. All right, guess the dream. Guest room, library. What do we save? <clears throat> Excuse me. Save our game. All right. Let's see what these two are up to. Wow, this is a very small library. Hmm, this script is unfamiliar to me. Wow, this really, this is really interesting. Oh, Mr. Yudo, what did he have to say? You mean when he was actually talking out of his mouth? Nothing that wasn't completely ridiculous? So he wants you to find the Divine Sword in order to halt the Day of Darkness. A dubious undertaking. We walk unguided through shadows. The only clue is the words, the Divine Sword rests with the Legion of Darkness. You find anything else about that? No, not in this place. Anyway, Mr. Yudo, you ought to read some of these books too. They have lots of details about Valmar and Grannis, the Battle of Good and Evil, the Day of Darkness, and even the, the Divine Sword. Dinner awaits in the other room, and books do not spoil or grow cold without use. Well, that's true. Let's eat again, because it's been, what, 20 minutes since we uh, ate? <laughs> wow, it's been a full day, I suppose. I guess. Is it in this room? Yeah. I heard that dinner's ready. It will be ready very soon. Please, wait a little while. I'm about to eat a lot of food. What good is it to chase after fancy now that the threat of darkness is upon us? No one has ever found the divine sword. How can he be so nonchalant about matters of such weight? I must consult my... auguries? I don't know. For some means of holding back the darkness. Well, that's not a good omen. This is an evil sign. The day of darkness draws near. Wah. This light. Millennia? What, uh, what you doing there? Ah. <laughs> ah, the wings of Valmar, Valmar here in the cathedral, someone, someone come, quickly. He's a very scared old man. Mm -hmm. Truly, bread is the body's life as the earth is to all that spring from it. So also a fine bread is loam for the soul. <laughs> well, this bread is delicious. Mr. Yudo, are you going to eat? Roan, Merrick, I'm going to look for that damn sword. I thought you would say that. This sword interests me, for I have not before heard of its like. You two coming along? It was ever more my intent. Please, let me come along too. I could use your help. I appreciate it. If it is his holiness Zara says, this has meaning for me too. What do you mean? 
Well, you see... Oh, damn it, not again. We're eating. Please, excuse me. I am told that Valmar has taken human form and entered the cathedral. Have you seen any suspicious persons? Huh? No, no one's been here. Please, excuse the interruption. I must go. Must be uh, must be millennia. What the hell is she thinking? Millennia. All right. Not sure. I don't remember where we go next. I think we we'll go to the other side. If I remember correctly. To the balcony. Yep, I was right. There she is. <sighs> Millennia. So, you're going to look for the Krenna Saber, right, Ryudo? <laughs> you! What the hell are you doing here? You're practically standing on the dinner plate of Granis. Oh, like I care. If Granis ever wakes up, the big god can smack me stupid. Long as I get to follow you around again, Ryudo. Uh, I don't think you've thought this through. See, when we find the sword, we're going to use it to stab evil people. Oh, you. You're concerned about me? No one has ever been such a gentleman to me before. Just do what you think is best. I don't think you understand what I'm saying here, Millennia. Don't worry about me. I know what I want, and we're running out of time. Hmm. What is her plan, exactly? Cathedral guest room. Oh, we're back here. That was a very short scene with millennia. All right. I think we head back to the big hall. Most likely. Most likely. Da, 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 da. There's Elena. And Zara. Well, Mr. Yudo, have you made up your mind? Hmm. One question. When we get the Grand Saber, will it belong to you, uh, the church? And how will it be used? The sole purpose of the sword is to strike down Valmar. As such, it belongs to none. For this great hope Granis has given to all. I'll take your word for it. to rock. We'll find the Granis Saber. But not for the sake of Granis or the church. Ryudo. Look, I'm sick of all the suffering in the world. If Granis won't do anything about it, then someone has to. Well, well, Mr. Ryudo. Elena, you should leave now as well. Your soul brims with light. Be strong in your mission. And do not yield your heart. Yes, your holiness, Sarah. Farewell. Lord Grana spoke to me last night. I am permitted to tell you this. Ryuda must face the past should he desire the divine sword. You should remember this. Ah, you should also take this along. It is sure to be useful. What is it? Book of Pre- Ah, oh, we got another book. Cool. Elena, take care. 
and remember well our words. Your Holiness. Bye. All right. Ryudo, thank you for accepting this request. I wasn't going to let a dainty little princess mince and prance about without her faithful and obedient bodyguard. Oh, Ryudo, you. Miss Elena, we're together again. Our paths again are as one. It is good. Thank you, everyone. Come on, let's get moving. All right. We have a new mission. Now it's all about getting to the cathedral and we're out of here already. All right. <clears throat> so, I am going to head to the store and see if we can buy some stuff. Well, more cutscenes. Never thought we'd travel together again. I'm counting on you, Elena. Okay? I feel the same way, Ryudo. Roan, Merrick, and Sky too. I'm counting on all of you. This time it might be more difficult for us. Difficult times are indeed upon us. Welcome is the comfort of friends in this hour. That's right. Traveling would not be fun at all without you, Miss Elena. But where to travel to? The Divine Sword is held by the Legion of Darkness. We can't just knock on their door and grab it and run. I am not familiar with this divine sword. I remember in the holy book containing a passage. The people of darkness continue to hide deep in the bowels of the earth. Is it a metaphor or is there a more substance is there more substance in it? Perhaps it is with these people we shall find the legion of darkness. Perhaps if we visit the kingdom of Siren where I lived, we might learn the meaning of these words. Got a lead? No, I, I just thought we might learn something useful. What other knowledge have we of which would it... What other knowledge would... I can't read. What other knowledge have we which would intimate a course of action? Something about confronting my past, which probably means... Melphus. Surely it could be none but he. Melphus. A long time it has been, brother. Brother. Now, now, you two. Anyway, the kingdom of Sirem. What is it like? Well, climate is warm there, and it's lots of water. Very good country. We don't need a weather report, kid. We need to find something, some leads. And we might as well start in the kingdom of Sirem. The kingdom of Sirem lies to the east of the St. High Mountains. Come on, let's go. Yes. Let us head to the Sire Kingdom of Sirem. It's the Kingdom of Cyrus. My name is Cyrus. All right, Saint Haim Haim Papal State. All right, so let's head to the general store. I might just do it off screen because it's not all that fun watching me. Ooh, bakery. I want some baked goods. General store. All right. I'm going to end this episode here. Um, and in the next one, we're going to be heading out of here. And uh, I'll be fully equipped and upgraded and a bunch of stuff. So, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.